Well, that's the trouble with a heartbreak. It's gonna hang around. Leave you me that breaking down. Wonder that all that it's gonna take it over. And then you can't. What's the good word, guys? Matt here, country song teacher. Hope you're doing well. Getting cozy by the fire. Y'all feel that? Hey, just YouTube um, live fireplace. It'll set the mood, right? Gotta love it. I we, uh, hope y'all doing well, man. We've had a cold day, a little cold last couple of days here in Raleigh, North Carolina. Um, my kids, I mean, literally, you could just see on top of my hot tub lid, like a quarter inch of snow. My kids ran out their gear and thinking they get a sleigh ride, all that kind of good stuff. I'm like, sorry, guys, it's gonna be a little bit of a letdown. There's not much, it's mostly just slush. But uh, super cold here, having a good time. Got a fun little jam, I have a lot of requests already. Y'all know if it's a new Jason Aldean, I gotta do it. Gonna capo that third fret. We're gonna use four chords. Let me show you here the chords. Again, keep, keep the capo on third fret. For the chorus, we're gonna do a G. So lock in the two bottom strings and go fifth and sixth. And then we're gonna do a, a D. I mean, a, a next one is gonna go, has a trouble with a heartbreak, it's gonna hang around. Next is a B minor. And if you're like, man, I'm a rookie. That's why I'm watching your videos. I can't do a B minor. So you can do the bar chord, great. If you can't, always know my hack. You take an A minor, which is second, fourth, and third. A minor, slip up two frets, and play the bottom four. So G, G, B minor, B minor. Now you're already in position to slide over to the two middle strings of the second fret. From the bottom five, that's your A, for four. So again, you're gonna do it twice. That's the trouble with a heartbreak. Gonna hang around. Leave you midnight, breaking down. Wonder now, love that is gonna take. Getting over her. If you can't drown, then gotta hurt. Now you can burn four wheels up down that road. But there ain't nowhere her memory can go. That's the trouble with a heartbreak. That's the trouble with a heartbreak. always say you probably saw me on my instagram country song teacher if you're not following respect me matching by the way uh, if you don't follow me on instagram just just my name country song teacher i talked about when i'm learning these songs i highly recommend this look up the chords wherever online and make sure you start out with just down strums you're teaching your ear how many beats per chord am i gonna do for this song so for example on this chorus you can go g for two b minor for two a two Particularly, I was this way, if you're a beginner, that up strum is going to throw you off. So one of the best things you can do is start out with just down strums to really get the timing. That's the trouble with a heartbreak, it's going to hang around. Give you midnight, breaking down, wanting to have long that it's going to take. Getting over her, if you can't drown, it makes me kind of hurt. Now you can burn for wheels and down that road, but then you know where her memory can go. That's the trouble. sound kind of choppy that's okay because you're getting that timing now i have to get one more used to it you do like sound even though i'm keeping that two count timing boom 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 there's a trouble with a That kind of thing. So on that, uh, let's keep um, on that chorus. It starts out. That's the trouble with a heart heartbreak. So I'm gonna go to a D. Uh, D chord. You can play two bottom strings and lock lock in two bottom strings. The third or a regular D, either way. But um, so let's start. I'm gonna go B minor D A. Now what I do here when I go from that D to an A. So watch this. I go. Two B minors. Now I see a regular D, third bottom string of the second fret, and the second string of the third fret. I do two Ds. Now I'm, from my, when I go from that D to an A, leave that ring finger on that second string, and then use your first finger and press the two middle strings of your second fret. Let's jump to bottom five. So it goes up. Don't let anybody tell you it's gonna be easy. It ain't easy. Repeat it. 
Don't let anybody tell you You know what it's like When they say So see how I did that? My battery's about to die here um, I hit low power mode, hope I didn't mess it up. So, two B minors, two Ds, four A's. Two B minors, two Ds, four A's. Get out of this town, be so bad, I need to get up in the crowd. So, B minor, get out of this town, be so bad, I need to get lost in the crowd. So, all you're doing is go back for the B minor. When I go from a D, remember I keep that ring finger down. If I go B minor, I just slide up to that kind of A. It goes, get out on this town, meet somebody new, get lost in the crowd. All I see is you, don't let anybody tell you. So see, you go back and forth twice on that B minor to A, but on the last line, it's B minor D, gonna be easy. So see what I mean there? Get out on this town, meet somebody new, get lost in the crowd, all I see is you, don't let anybody D tell you, it's gonna be easy. Has the trouble with the heartbreak, it's gonna hurt your man. Real fast guys, let me go ahead and plug tomorrow's video, what I was gonna do today, and I ended up pushing it back a day, because I've had so many requests for this song. People ask me every single day, at least every other day, um, how to sing and play guitar at the same time. You struggle with that. I struggle with years. At, at times, I'll be honest, I still struggle with it. But people ask me all the time, Matt, how do you sing and play guitar at the same time? So tomorrow, Tuesday, or whatever day you're watching this, at 7 p.m., on this channel, by the way, I do new videos uh, at least Monday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, at least those four days at 7 p.m. Eastern time. So tomorrow at 7 p.m., I'm gonna do a video about singing and playing guitar at the same time give you all my tips that help me, what I see people do wrong a lot of times, what I used to do wrong a lot of times, what I still often do wrong a lot of times when I'm messing up. So be sure you stay tuned to the channel and you can check out that video, how to sing and play guitar at the same time. Because I yeah, know y'all, y'all want to impress the ladies. Why else would you play guitar unless to impress the ladies, right? There ain't no reason. There's no other reason, right? So uh, I always tell the people, what my wife, I was chasing my wife super hard. And, uh, you know, she's kind of like, get lost, dude, whatever. And she said she like, one day looked over and saw me playing guitar. She thought, you know what? He's kind of cute. Uh-huh. Y'all see it? Y'all see it? Oh. So anyway, so from that point on, she kind of had a little thing for me. We've been going ever since. So guys, learn that guitar. Uh, by the way, the capo third fret puts it in the same key as Jason Aldean. If, if sorry, you don't have a capo, remember, you can always, a lot of people, I forget, sometimes beginners don't know this. You can always play without the capo. It's just going to be in a different key. Has a trouble with a heart. 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 All right, guys, thank y'all so much for the support. Um, man, y'all, we're getting close to that 200,000 subscribers. That's crazy. So crazy, man. I'm pumped. Anyway, guys, check out the website, countrysongteacher.com. After you do like this little guy here, this is just a reminder when you see that, my video, smash that like button for the good old YouTube algorithm. If y'all aren't smashing the like button, YouTube just says, ah, screw that video. Ain't nobody want to watch that. Screw that. Put that back in the archives. How do you say it, archives? Put it, ain't nobody watching that. But if you smash the like button, YouTube's like, you get a map video, you get a map video, you get a map video. Okay, I've had too much caffeine this morning. I love you guys. Check out the website, countrysongteacher.com. Ton of y'all this weekend got my four chord song book. I got one one song book is 40 songs, 10 bucks. Or the bundle is uh, 80 songs for 18 bucks. So go check that out, countrysongteacher.com. And subscribe if you have not. I'll see you guys tomorrow for how to sing and play guitar at the same time. Let's go.